We've got handles on the underside, and we've also got handles up top. We also have a built-in 4K HD camera. More about that a little bit later. That was just a teaser. So, to bring the TV off the wall, I'm going to push in this button for about five seconds. There's one on either side, and you only need to push in one of them. This is going to disengage the active and the active loop vacuum technology. So it's going to kill the vacuums. You're still going to hear a bit of a suction tug when I remove it. And at less than 20 pounds, I am in no hurry to find a home for this TV. I'll be able to hold it for as long as I need to. And then I'm going to pop it back on. So let's do it. I got a hold on the handles. I'm gonna push in the button. It's gonna make a little bit of a click in about five seconds. There it is. Pop it right off. You're allowed to cheer. That's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're allowed. You're allowed. So get a good look. And now I'm gonna show you this side to show you that the image is still there. The Wi Fi sucks, but the image is still there. <laughs> it's buffering. And like I said, at 20 pounds, I can hang out here all day. All day. So here's how this is going to work. These vacuums have sensors on them that automatically detect when it's being pressed up against a flat surface. Upon that detection, the vacuums are going to fire up on their own. You're going to hear a light whirring. Well, it's actually quiet enough that you on that side of the glass, you're probably not going to hear it. I'm going to hear it because my head's going to be right here. I'm going to hear a light whirring sound. The pitch of that sound is going to increase to let me know that the seal is getting tighter. When the sound stops, it is now snug enough for me to let it go. Let's see what happens. So I'm going to hold it up. I'm going to give it a little nudge. There's the noise. Five seconds later, there it is. 